everyone, Digital David here. Today in this video, I'm gonna be checking out the SanDisk Extreme Pro Portable SSD. This is the two terabyte version, but they have multiple capacities available. If you're interested in this product or you wanna find out more about it, the link to it will be in the video description. Here's a look at the retail box and packaging. Everything looks great. They have a nice profile image of the drive. They have some of the key features on the back. This does have water and dust resistance. It's IP55 rated. The key thing with this drive is gonna be its read and write speeds at up to 2000 megabytes per second. Just make sure you have USB 3.2 Gen 2x2 two two to get those speeds. Now let's go ahead, let's open it up and see what's inside. Here are all the contents. First up, we have our product literature. This drive does come with a five year warranty. Next, you'll see we have two USB cables. One is gonna be USB type A to USB type C. The other one's gonna be USB type C to USB type C. And lastly, we have the drive itself. This looks really good. SanDisk logo and branding, carabiner clip here, our blue and orange color scheme all throughout. You'll see our USB type C port right there. On the back, we have additional product information. This is the two terabyte version as is clearly labeled on it. Nice rubber silicone grip on the back. I don't know what you wanna call that, but super smooth and soft. Then we have our textured front right here, gonna be more of like your plastic material with metal around the carabiner clip spot. So really cool drive, definitely has like a rugged premium look and feel to it. They do a nice job there, but smooth again to have in your pocket, things like that. So comfortable to travel and take with you. Now let's go ahead, let's plug it in and try it out. With the drive plugged in, you'll see we have an official capacity of 1.81 terabytes of usable free space on this drive. And talking about performance, they advertise 2000 megabytes per second read and write speeds. And we nearly got that with Crystal Disk Mark. Look at our results. We actually exceeded the read score that they advertised by 17.33 megabytes. And we fell 0.2 megabytes per second shy of their advertised write speeds. Moving along to AS SSD, this software always has scores even lower than Crystal Disk Mark. That holds up true in this case as well. So we got a read score of 1,676.91 megabytes per second and a write score of 1,680.01 megabytes per second. So that's what you can expect real world use case scenario with this drive from common benchmarking software that you have access to as well. But it's great to see when our numbers can be close enough, if not exceed what they advertise. And last but not least, just for fun, I thought I'd show you what it's like to copy over a bunch of project files and video files here. We have almost 1.5 terabytes that we'll be copying on this drive. I wanna show you some real world results here as we drag this folder to the drive. So you'll see how it's gonna process within Windows. So 670 items, 1.46 terabytes, and you'll see the current speed that we're getting here. Now keep in mind, we have this going from a server to this computer over a 10 gig network, but it's connected to a 2.5 gig or so your results may vary depending on your networking. If you're doing like direct copy and paste from your computer's hard drive to the drive or over network like we're doing here, but that's really fast compared to what we were seeing with previous generation drives, even from SanDisk. So that's got me excited. Just make sure with this drive, you're taking advantage of the correct port. That's what you're gonna need to know to take advantage of the speeds. If you don't have that port, then save your money, get the exact same drive, just with the slower read and write speeds to save a couple of bucks because you're not gonna be taking advantage of it anyways. 